Hi, I'm Ben from Cat Dimensions, and I have a question for you. Have you ever wondered what it takes to protect an egg from a brick? Well, today you will find out. So for the Humpty Dumpty Defender, we have a three-part design where we have a sliding faceplate that should deflect the brick. We have a cage to protect the egg. And then we have a little cradle that holds the egg into place and it will slide into our cage here. So when it hits, this is gonna break off. This is gonna go that way and the egg will stay safe. Ideally, well. yeah, the, the brick is gonna take this faceplate down, deflect it all away from the egg. Got it. All right, before we do any of these tasks, let's look at this one, too. Oh, you want to look at the thunder cone? I want to look at the thunder cone. <laughs> the thunder cone. <laughs> so this is the thunder cone. Our uh, main intent was mostly to just basically deflect the brick, uh, basically with using a lot of good material, round design, to try to avoid any form of a uh, stress concentrator. But uh, yeah, we put a nice little thunder cone on the side having a, ha a hanging basket in the center to hold the egg, which uh, we'll see how long that lasts, to be completely honest. Uh, but uh, yeah, that's pretty much the Thundercone, which also says hit me on top, but it doesn't, didn't come through very well. So before we start, who do you think is going to win? I think the Thundercone, even with its weak basket. Thundercone. Thundercone? Yep. I don't want to make it a unanimous vote. <laughs> Thundercone. <laughs> After Ooh. looking at our tests, we used like a little tiny 3D printed soldier and just looking at how durable that little piece was, you know, looking at how big the thunder cone is. I think that deflecting versus just handling the impact, I really do think the thunder cone might win this one just because it's so tough. Oh, by the way, printed on our, what, what is the uh, material? Nylon CF10. Nylon CF10, is yeah. that supposed to be durable? Absolutely. Absolutely. That's 24 inches. Humpty Dumpty at two feet. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh my gosh. Oh. Are you kidding? Falls right out. This is not damaged at all. Actually, I can't even. It's got a few scratches, maybe, oh but that, there's like no damage at all. Um, but then you look at the egg, and I would say that this didn't pass. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Here. Oh, there. no. Oh, that's the one with the liner. Oh, <laughs> too late. I will be watching that garbage can later. This is messy. <laughs> Could have integrated the design and just have have it like rods on a hole. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Print it. Print it. Yeah. yeah, should have done that. Yeah, variable. That's at two feet. Okay. Well, I really hope that the video isn't over at uh, at two feet. Anyway, this is thunder cone at twenty four inches. Three, two, one. Hell yeah. It. <laughs> May have it pranked. made the brick jump. Yeah. You know, it's like the simulation says. You snapped the handles. I knew, I knew that was going to go. Yeah. I think. Well, maybe yeah, I think the egg's okay. I think it is yeah, too. Yeah, the egg. It took a couple tests. I'm afraid of it falling off of the brick. Here, you, you can lift it. <laughs> All right, yeah. Oh, that good. egg is. Yeah, it did break a. Wah wah. Break a handle. Uh, that egg is completely fine. Sweet. There might be some scratches on it, but. <laughs> So we'll go with plan B, <laughs> which is just stick it in the basket. Okay, so what are you doing and uh, why are you cheating? We're cheating. We're definitely cheating. Um, so oh. in the last test, when the brick popped our entire uh, device up, yep. the bottom plate came sliding out and that's what broke the egg. So our thought is if I can hold the plate in place, then it will all move as one unit and we should not have the egg rolling out like it did in the first test. That's like yeah. exactly 24 inches. This is try number two for Humpty Dumpty. Three, two, one. Come on. It's 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 it's
Wait, there is a crack. Oh no, it's bleeding. Oh no. There is a crack. Oh yeah, oh, that's uh, yeah. Toss that egg. All right, I, I'd say it. It survived it all. Survived. Yeah. Survived. I just want to. I just want to point out something. You had how many grams of material to work with? A lot. And you had spare. We decided. How big are these <laughs> tiny little arms? A tenth of an inch. <laughs> Not even. I think they're even less than that. You have this massive cone. And then you, have you know what we could have done? The smallest little mini arms. arms. <laughs> yeah. Hey, we used the. Uh, we decided to skimp on the material here so we could write thunder cone with a lightning bolt <laughs> inside. Thunder cone! There you go. Alright. Three feet. Oh, I almost hit my head on that. That'll be fun. Three. Two, one. Holy wow. That's not yet. That is flawless. Crazy. Just keep going up. We're just going to go all the way with the thunder cone. That's amazing. There's like zero damage at all in this thing. I don't even have to check it. This didn't even move at all. So congratulations. <laughs> so this is Humpty Dumpty at three feet. Tom, what did you do to it? We added a little bit better tape to keep, to keep the base connected to the uh, to the rest of the frame. Three, two, one. Wow. It's still showing the thing. It's like work. It actually finally break up. The tape <laughs> worked. <laughs> oh, that's going to be so okay. <laughs> I need to say break. Has, <laughs> all right, not to... Uh, I don't even know what to say. It's just, it hasn't saved a single egg. No. It's a Humpty Dumpty murder. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, this is uh... It's an egg breaking movie. Yeah, it's just, yeah. It's, honestly, it's just making a huge mess every time. So maybe we don't, yeah, we let's finish. just, yeah, no, this is done. Yeah. This is the only damage it has. Is that so? The material itself is wicked durable. So you just dropped a brick on it multiple times. Definitely not a material issue. Um, but yeah, design could not put Humpty Dumpty back together again. I think that once you get to a point where it's so heavy, and if we hit it like right on the top and it doesn't move, I think it would be better. I think it'll be safer. So, if you're curious, when we did all the tests and the simulations and everything, our weakest points here, uh, we tried to tighten it up by basically, when we redesigned it after the sim study, just putting some ribs in on the inside, just so you can get some more force coming down the sides yep. and avoiding this area, uh, yeah, hopefully. Yeah. The other part, too, that was weak technically was this, but <laughs> in theory, this should snap first. This is Thundercone at four feet. There's a new egg in it, and uh, yeah, I'll go to this side so you can see it better. All right. Thunder cone at four feet. Three, two, one. Whoa! Roll. Oh. If that was a brick, almost. <laughs> <laughs> that brick landed here, and that egg landed right yeah. here. So let's review this. Oh, uh, really? Still not a lot of damage. Yeah. You can see a couple little scuffs. It still clearly says hit me. <laughs> that impact zone is what's doing it. Or we'll say roughly 30. It works for shipping. Yeah, it's close enough for shipping. Yeah. Alright, that's on. This cinder block is 30 pounds. It's at 45.5 inches from bottom to that plate. Thundercone's gonna come up and compel me. At 30 pounds. <laughs> Do you want to stand in front of this printer? I think we should, with our bodies, protect in case there's a ricochet. Oh, you have any predictions? <laughs> Someone gave me dirt. This is our last test. <laughs> Wait, one. Oh, no. no way! Oh, no. Oh, no. no way! It survived. <laughs> that, is an that is an intact egg. Oh, wait, wait. oh, it is a little crack. Broke the brick. Are you kidding? Broke the brick in half. <laughs> <laughs> How's the crumple zone doing? The crumple zone is crumpled. That's what I would say. <laughs> yeah. Is there any other, like, 
Not even a deflection now. Okay. Hey man, have you heard anything else about that project? What are you doing? Hey, I'm uh, I'm saving my CAD files to the clouds. The clouds. Don't you save your CAD files to the clouds? I save my CAD files to the cloud. Yeah. Like singular. You just want me to show you? I guess so. It's uh, it's saved successfully. So, what's your plan for uh, revisions? Revisions? Probably should have used 3D experience for that. All right, we're gonna cut the cameras. We're gonna go inside and drop it from the roof, which was, I'm not joking, this was my goal the entire time. And they said it was gonna last until after four feet. Now we're going to the roof and dropping a cinder block off of the cup. So, nice job. Thunder call. Thunder call. Let's turn the cup. Broke the cinder block, broke the plate, and the egg is broke broke. under oh, oh, the egg. It sucked the egg. Look at this. You can see the outline of where the cone was. The egg is perfectly intact. That's a great design. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Very nice. Good design. Broke right where I thought it was. Good yes. design.